and Jean-Serge Gagnon here today we're going to talk about the difference between Click eCourse and Teachables now both of those are course hosting platforms places where you can host your digital courses your online courses and hopefully generate income from it so we're going to talk about those two platforms in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets all right so Teachable is one of the websites that allows you to host your courses so that you can sell them and you can generate some income from your digital courses now we're going to show you the difference between teachable and clicky course and the I guess the pros and cons of them right and if you don't know clicky course is my own platform something I've created so of course I might be biased but I want to show an honest difference and and showing you what is better on one and on the other right so I want you to have a, a, a an honest view of it and um, yeah so we're going to talk about that in just a second but if you're listening to the audio of this you're going to want to go check out the, the video and the blog post at cis358.jsgagnon.com go and see the video and the blog post because I will be sharing the screen which let's get right to it right now I'm actually going to go share my screen here and I'm going to show you what the different sites are so first of all teachable you go to teachable.com you're going to see basically this page where they talk about what is teachable and they basically have a, a simple simple statement there share what you know create online course and coach and create online courses and coaching services transform your experience and know-how into a thriving knowledge business and then they just have enter your email and get started right so I already have a teachable account I'm not sure if I'll be able to show you the process but that's what I'll try to do and then the other one if you go to Click eCourse you go to clickecourse.com you end up on this page which also talks about what is Click eCourse where they talk about selling your own courses an online public community driven for a completely private environment you can take a course in an easy navigate environment with precise bookmarking across multiple devices and so on and then of course we talk about why affiliates would want to use it why marketers why teachers and why students would want to with you know some little bits about what the platform is all right so let's go back to teachable here so let's take some notes I actually I have a document here that I opened up to take some notes where is it right here uh, this one here so what's the difference between them right so first the first difference I'm going to obviously be obvious uh obviously transparent about so number one is UI is much much more modern modern on teachable okay so that's probably a very high positive for teachable um you know that's that's the name of the game right UIs keep changing all the time maybe we'll get Click eCourse to look better but that's really you know it's a UI it's great to have a nice looking UI definitely is positive uh, but at the same time it doesn't change well anyways I'm not going to go get into that okay so the UI is nicer it's a lot nicer they got some really nice nice looking flow to it they got these these li these links at the top if you click on features you can see what the features are on teachable uh it's loading up okay there you go um on teachable let's see what the features are this is your show build the business you're proud of we'll keep growing it easy as it goes use our domain to connect to your own customize your online school experience use tools you want to use uh, know your numbers sell 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 make a team effort and that's basically what it's if you look through you scroll down you see they have uh different things follow the money they have different features here learn about our payment features let's talk security so they basically kind of give you a really very basic overview of what the features are which definitely looks good if we go to click eCourse you can look at the plans over here to see what the features are and maybe we need a page like that right the feature page is much more I uh, how could I put it human readable or simpler let's go back to our notes here so this is the list of features on Click eCourse it's very you know listed uh, very very simple not very 
not no no images or anything like that so that's another plus I would say for teachable in terms of looks of the site definitely let's go back to the notes here I got the notes um okay so number two feature page is also very nice looking on teachable on teachable um however whoops plans page is very detailed on click ecourse right so on click ecourse you really have the list of the features the details uh with the different plans now if we look at teachables we go back to the teachables on the main page again right there's a pricing tab right here if I click on pricing it basically shows you three different pricing with monthly and the annual uh, pricing right so there is there is no free plan as far as I can tell I, I, I mean I don't know they say you get get started for free but I mean what does that mean right that's kind of confusing to me uh, pricing features blogs so if I if I look at this whereas if you go to click eCourse again it's on the plans page there's six membership options uh there there's more there's more options right so there's free beginner influencer professional extreme so these these four plans or five plans if you will there's five different plans on click eCourse um and the pricing is down here so 100 a year 300 750 or 10 30 75 150 a month right or there is a free option whereas on teachable there's no free option so let's go back to the list here we have our list so number three pricing so teachable teachable is 39 let's see what do they have they have 29 99 249 okay 29 99 or 229 a month that's paid yearly um now what's the option if they say monthly or oh, 39 119 299 uh let's do that or what is it it's 39 119 39 119 or 2.99 a month okay so that's paid pricing uh with uh with uh with click eCourse we have um free 10 uh, 25 75 or 150 a month uh, let's see I don't I don't I didn't uh, the site doesn't show you the so it's 10 30 75 oh sorry it's 10 30 30 75 or 150 and then this and on click course is two free months if paid yearly okay so that's kind of how it works okay so that's pricing um the obviously uh on clicky course having a free starting point to even host a course is definitely a plus in the sense that you can actually at least get to see what the platform looks like how to use it and all that right all right so now let's go back to teachable so if if you look at the list of features right for each of the different things it talks about unlimited students it's unlimited on clicky course as well they talk about five let's do that let's do that features unlimited students so features okay number four feature feature specific features specific features okay so number one let's go for students uh let's say unlimited students unlimited students same on both same on both okay so click eCourse and uh, teachable has unlimited students the next one is transaction fees so five percent transaction tra let's just say transaction fees transaction fees so five percent on lowest cost in teachable teachable no fees on higher accounts or on clicky course 
I should probably do some sort of a some sort of a table or something right on the blog page which I which the blog site will have these kinds of things so the difference is right okay number three the next one what is it course product course product course product coaching product coaching product so I'm not really sure definitely course products both whoops and I don't know what coaching product is right so coaching products teachables not sure what it is let's take a look at what that is maybe I can tell what can I can I see what's a coach including in all plans unlimited video unlimited courses unlimited hosting integrated payment basic quizzes no fee or on free course no fees on free courses so that's nice um student management lecture com compare plans what does that tell us <laughs> okay select okay so what is it transaction fees free courses zero 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 paid courses zero with a question transaction processed by the monthly payment gateway for schools that were created before will be subject to a two percent fee oh, interesting processing fees oh look at that they have processing fees but are these processing fees by say PayPal sales made via US oh okay so these are PayPal fees which we would have the same on Click eCourse there's no real we can't control that if you're using PayPal you're going to get charged whatever PayPal charges right chargeback fee I don't know what that is chargebacks in curfewing the chargeback is withdrawn so these are fees that are probably going to be the same on Click eCourse because they're not under our control so that's good that they have these same processing fees see processing fees adhere to the standard rate charged by Stripe and PayPal okay all right so payouts teachable payments gateway daily so what does that mean native payment gateway available uh okay monthly payment gateways Mon native payment okay monthly so I'm not really sure what they're trying to say here but payouts on Click eCourse are uh, 30 days after we get the funds from a course sold we keep it in case they want a refund otherwise we send you the funds um, after the 30 days so I don't know what they say by when they when they mean by daily but that would be payments available right uh, I wish I anyways I don't I can't really so unlimited hosting unlimited video bandwidth unlimited students unlimited courses so none of these none of these things we don't have any of these limits on any of them on Click eCourse either email support obviously is available there's no we don't have live chat well we do I suppose if you try to reach me I can certainly have a conversation with you admin level users we don't have any kind of limits on that there's unlimited so let's just put that in the list here um so let's see um videos unlimited students oh it's up there too unlimited lessons unlimited okay so we actually with clicky of course we do have limits for students for videos limits based on plans and then I'm gonna have to do students is unlimited this one is the same thing limits based on plans okay what else there's also what else did they have there they had uh they had they had uh unlimited video bandwidth unlimited hosting hosting I don't know what that means unlimited for us is the same video band width is unlimited for both of us okay so now what's the next thing I was wanting to look at the admin thing so they're talking about the admin thing um admin level users okay admin level users they have they have and whoops admin level users so they have two ten and twenty I think right two five and two five and twenty click ecourse 
unlimited so we don't have a limit like that you can set any number of people as admins of your courses and you can have the course set up so that an, a person is an admin of your course or an admin of your site right so admin level users unlimited uh, per course whoops per course or per site now when we say site it's kind of like a school idea with uh, with um, teachables right okay what else can we see here student management so I'm not sure what they mean by student management um it would be nice if they actually said what they meant by it but with us so let's just say student management so um uh, clicky course basically we can you can see the students and their progression in the course of course you can also email them and uh, well there's lots of other things you can do too but anyways okay let's do that now what else lecture lecture comments we can do comments <coughs> so comments comments <coughs> um so on teachable I'm not even sure what they mean lecture comments comments click e-course in lessons courses or files so in inside of click e-course you can do comments on any of those things right so okay so now what else let's go back down here to the teachables so basic quizzes they talk about basic quizzes quizzes teachable teachable basic uh, click e-course uh, you can create a course uh, you can create a quiz so quiz quizzes with multiple answer options in modules in module modules okay I, I'll have to explain that maybe but quizzes with an s quizzes is that how you write quizzes two z's yes okay what's next the next thing is common custom domain yes of course you can do custom domain custom domain yes both on uh, only in paid plan in click e course so that's the thing so there are things you don't get with the free account right I mean um unlimited students course products coaching products okay so actually I should probably update this to kind of explain um unlimited unlimited on teachables teachable there's no s on teachables it's teachable um click e-course click click e-course limits based on account um, plan right so the ch the, ch the choice you make for the plan like if I look at the plans here the different plans the number of courses where is it how many syndication membership sites maximum courses so you can create a certain number of courses now this we might decide to change that to unlimited I guess it really depends on how anyways but for now that's kind of how it is maximum courses and maximum uh, videos so that means lessons right lessons you can have a certain maximum overall your whole account and that's kind of how that works uh, number of membership sites you can create so these are sites you can have basically like a, another um, school if you will right all right so that's what that is um this is hosting I don't know they don't talk about that right right in here right okay let's go back now what else do they talk about integrated email marketing community integration third-party integration what is that single sign-on with circle.so I don't know what that means maybe it means login this with Facebook 
third-party integrations include Facebook Google Sumo Segment MailChimp ConvertKit okay so okay let's just do that so integrate drip course content actually coupon codes oh yeah coupon codes coupon codes coupon codes coupon codes yes for both now I'm not sure how the coupon codes work on teachables compared to Click eCourse but we both have that then the next one is drip course content so that's actually one of the features that does not exist on Click eCourse but I should we should definitely yes teachable teachable not yet in Click eCourse but I mean if there's if there's lots of people that want it maybe that's something we can certainly implement uh and actually I do want to implement that for the summits because the summits I want to drip every day right a new video um based on 24-hour access right so that could be used for that integrated email marketing so let's just uh whoops why is it not letting me come on just select that there you go okay integrated email marketing teachable yes I'm not sure the extent of how that works right with teachable because you might not have access to who the the students are or anything like that right but anyways I don't know uh click eCourse in development right now so there is a feature but it's not uh, fully functional yet or completed I should say uh what else then we have community integration I'm not even sure what they mean by that but um let's say community integration teachable maybe I should have done a, a, a instead I should have done a, a spreadsheet for this right it would be a lot easier but I'll I'll be doing that with the blog post anyways okay so teachable uh, yes click ecourse its own social platform so in click e in click ecourse you actually have what's called a feed right here right now we're not logged in so we can't really we can't do other anything other than seeing it but the feed lets you see things that happen on the platform like new courses being added people updating their profile picture new lessons being added to existing courses uh, as you can see there's these up uh, these uh, profile updates you can see what else can we see see comments people commenting on things uh people rating rating a course right people updating their uh, profile pictures uh, people uh, again rating courses right uh, things like that right so those are all things that uh, you see on clicky courses basically in, in a platform a social media platform as well all right so we're going to go back so third-party integrations that's interesting because that's something that's been in development so third-party integrations so over here we have third-party integrations teachable uh teachables they say they have can I copy this somehow I can there teachable as this and clicky course of course uh Zapier a, a Weber now for now that's in development a Weber in development okay so it's not it's not available yet it's in development all right so now what else what else what else integrated affiliate program oh look at that so integrated affiliate program teachable only in top two plans click eCourse yes free so the plan the the integrated affiliate program even allows you to get gen income from people you refer to the platform that use the platform and pay a monthly fee on the plan right so you even get a commission on that so what else Zapier in integration that's pretty interesting that they talk about this here but uh that's not uh, yeah course completion oh my god there's a whole bunch of other things I so obviously I can't get through all of this stuff uh, but what else member only community course creating training group coaching calls okay so you get those kinds of things when you pay extra that teachables well actually there's a few more let's just do that let's zip your integration teachable only in 
top top two planes click ecourse in dev oh thanks okay what else there's the next thing was graded quizzes graded quizzes teachable what do they say they say only in top two plans click e-course yes uh actually no it's uh quizzes are only available at the paid plan in paid plans okay then what else course completion certificate so we don't even have that but that would be kind of cool to have shouldn't be too complicated to set up so course teachable teachable only in top two plans click e-course e-course no but I could that could be something that could be done pretty easily right we could certainly integrate that course compliance huh. I'm not even sure what that means course compliance teachable in top two plans the key course no not sure what this is so I'm not sure what that is maybe I should look it up to see what they're talking about upsells upsells so I guess upsells teachable only in top two plans Click eCourse in um, let's just say so upsells in Click eCourse is in development. It's something that we we have in our list of things that we need to do. So what else? Advanced reports. I don't know. Advanced reports. Teachable in top two plans. Click eCourse not yet let's just say not yet because whatever advanced reports are obviously it's it's a very custom unbranded website unbranded website teachable top two click ecourse top three so that's basically if I go to click ecourse here uh, if I go back to the plans and we look at what is it uh, brand white label private membership sites that's inside of the top two plans as well okay so top two top two okay unbranded then we have what else the next thing advanced developer customization whoa that's interesting advanced developer customization teachable top plan click e-course mm can be arranged in top plan let's say top plan as well because that's one of the things that you know you like what is what does it mean right what kind of customization does somebody need right custom user roles custom user roles hmm. custom user roles teachable top plan right it's just the top one yes top plan click e-course not sure what this is so we'll have to look into it and then bulk import students teachable top plan click e-course not not yet so that could be something that could be done the import right you just have a file and then the, the members only community uh course creator training what is that access to training course teachable you right and all that so that's kind of the differences between clicky course and a teachable now um I guess I should go back to the list like let's take a look you know what we sh definitely I need to be doing is also saying okay what is it that's in clicky course that doesn't exist in in teachable so let's see um so public pages and posts so in let's say public so public page so pages let's just call it pages and posts 
uh, click eCourse so okay let's just do that like this let's say click eCourse specific features not available on teachable so let's just do that like that then I can whenever I do the the list right I can kind of do that so page pages and posts um uh, uh, in the feed right so in the feed there's going to be so pages is something that's in in development uh but it's it's basically means that inside the feed you're going to be able to see if I open this in a separate tab here so in the feed right you're going to be able to see posts that relate to pages that on it's kind of like a Facebook page right where basically you have content that's only on that person like this is Donna here if I go to Donna's profile it's basically I have a picture of her there and then if I look at her news in the news it'll show her profile updates right so she did two profile updates here or this might have been the automated one from Facebook but that's the news feed of Donna but there could be a there's you can have a page with a feed like this where you can have different things be uh, showing up inside of the in, of the page okay that's what pages are public groups now groups are the same as similar to Facebook where you can have people in groups and you can post so that's something else that isn't um so groups um so groups groups to share content to specific users so that's kind of like so private public and secret groups so that's something else that's mostly done but it hasn't been public published yet but that's a feature that you can't find on teachable obviously uh, public posts in the news feed right here public comments on courses and lessons so comments uh, public profiles view free courses and lessons and can buy courses so so this is basically as a anonymous user somebody who's not even logged into the site doesn't have a, an account you can actually buy a course and what happens is it automatically creates an account for you based on your buy your email address that you bought it for and yeah so um okay so now what else in the free plan there's all these things create public pages and post to them public private access weekly training um, create open access self-directed courses save progress of courses now I imagine that that's something that can be done on, on teachable and I'm not going to bother it you can embed videos from YouTube Facebook and Vimeo and I'm, I'm not sure if you can do that on teachables or not you can send private messages yeah so that's another thing uh private messages private messages to other students and users on the platform right basically a social media feature right um what else you can comment on courses lessons and or news feed and rate courses you can earn income by referring others to buy courses there's even a syndication engine where you can upload videos and generate assets from those videos like screenshot uh, thumbnails of them or audio taking the audio out or creating a trimmed or shorter version of the video um, and adding a footer to it and things like that uh, there's all sorts of different things you can do so that's definitely a feature that's not on any other platform so syndication engine so then what um create upload and give away your own courses mo create modules to organize lessons and files so you can have instead of just having a course with lessons in it right lesson one lesson two lesson three you can actually create a course with modules where you inside of a module you can have more than one lesson you can have files you can have, even have a quiz things like that so that's something that I think teachable lets you do but they don't really talk about it because maybe it's an obvious thing or maybe maybe you can't do it I don't know if I, <coughs> I would have to I would actually have to try to create a course in teachable right to see how that works I'm sorry okay so I can hide profile from public view so if you're not if you're on as as whenever you create an account you don't have to be a public account in other words when I go here I can see Donna here I can go to her profile but that she doesn't she could change it so I couldn't right and that's one of the things you can do on um, clicky course can hide your profile 
from others hide your you so make it private or friends only so by the way you can create friends so friends friends management and okay friends management so that means you can have friends on click ecourse whenever that feature is enabled you'll be able to do that so I can go if I'm logged in here I'm not logged in so there's gonna be a friends tab maybe and you'll be able to see who's who's friends with Donna just the same as other social platforms right uh, what else what else do we have here we have your own blog you have your own blog your own blog site so your own blog site so uh, wordpress wordpress driven site so you can have your own your own blog on on here what else can you do um earn income by selling your own courses okay so now in the that's all these are all things you can do in the free plan right maybe we'll we'll move the blog to a paid plan right now it's in the free plan same thing with the syndication engine that's part of the free plan maybe we'll move it to the to the uh, to the paid plan but there is differences like for example the syndication engine you have a maximum um syndication where is it and how many syndication projects can you have per month right so on the free plan you can only do one so that means that after you've done one you can't do another one for the month and then on the other ones it's 4 12 35 120 right so the number you can do changes based on what plan you're on so that at least allows you to see how the engine works and use it for one right then the other thing is queue priority for downloads so if you're on the free plan you're a lower you're a higher queue priority which, well I guess it's a higher number it should probably be the other way around but anyways the priority is 50 which means you're low low in the priority that means if there's other people on the platform doing certain things you're going to get done later right but it's just a queue so it eventually happens anyways okay that's basically that okay so the last uh, the RS, R, yeah there's the other thing rss feed so rss feed for um audio audio uh what do you call them <laughs> it says right here podcast audio podcast podcast so you can for example you can have your videos that you post you can create a, a podcast out of them just by just by putting the url in say in soundcloud or well maybe not soundcloud but lots of the platforms out there they just want a url right so you can just paste that url and you'll automatically create you know a um a podcast so you can do that uh what else what else can we do so this is paid plans paid plans okay rss feed what else what else do we got uh, referring others to become paying members you can generate income from talking to people about the platform what else you can create public membership sites with your own domain name so you can create a new membership site where you can have one or multiple courses in it um so that you're not you don't have a, all the other courses that are on the platform in it you just have yours and you can set it up with your own domain where uh let's see so it says feeds so your own membership site with your own domain right so that's the paid plans <clears throat> now what else you can have um allow whoops allow students to download mp3 audio of your videos paid plans right and what else we can do also so I'm going to stop here because there's lots more stuff that you can look at um but um a lot of memberships and yeah so there's other things disabling intro uh, download video from YouTube for you uh upload video files instead of having host them elsewhere uh, membership site private you can make the membership site private when you pay at the higher plans um you can create live scheduled courses ability to hide ads from your view anyways like I said there's a whole bunch of other things that you can do on Click eCourse 
so that kind of kind of goes through the difference between teachables right teachable is really uh it's really a uh, a great a great site it's really a very nicely done site and I'm sure for most people this is good enough if you're just wanting to host a course you probably can use teachables but if you want to do something more advanced if you want to have the social media side of things you want to have the friends thing you want to have the 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 posting the the blog side the uh, being able to have uh, modules being able to have a syndication engine all those things if you want all those things on top right teachable doesn't have those things you'd have to get another another platform to do that so this is kind of you know um, like I said on Click eCourse where you would have all these other features that aren't on the other sites right if I look at the the feed here that's kind of one of the things you don't get on any other uh site on any other I don't think anyways well I'll I'll do another comparison for another site in another day another time but this is basically the 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 feed on Click eCourse right so and yeah and like I said on on Teachable it is a really nice site lots of cool things the UI is very nice and uh it lets you do lots of things um, but that's the difference between Click eCourse and uh, Teachable all right hopefully you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next video this has been Course Income Secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.